Hello, it's homework help week eight, day one. In the first problem, it wants us to find the area of this triangle. Now, I know it's a triangle, but I don't see the dimensions. So that means we've got to do some dimensions figuring out here. So remember, area of a triangle is half times the base times the height. So we need the base and the height in order to figure out the area. So let's start with the base. Um, I'm going to go across the bottom of the triangle and I'm going to count those units. So I have one, oops, sorry, that's, don't want to move it. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it is seven units along the base. Now the height, we have to make sure we go from the highest point right here, straight down to the lowest point there. So when I do that, I'm gonna count those units. It is one, two, three, four. So it is four units high. And if I multiply half times seven times four, I get 14, and it would be square units because they don't label the units anything else, so that's square units. All right, let's go to the bottom problem. This says use dimensional analysis to change 20 cups to gallons. So I'm gonna start by writing 20 cups as a fraction, 20 over one. And then I'm gonna multiply by a fraction using one gallon of 16 cups, but remember the cups need to be diagonal from each other. So they need to be the cups, cups, diagonal. And 16 cups is one gallon. Now we'll do some bow tie reducing. Remember the cups unit cancels. That's why our answer will be in gallons because that's the only unit that's left. Um, the 16 and the 20 can divide by four. So 16 divided by four is four. 20 divided by four is five. So I'm gonna now multiply my numerators, five times one, and my denominator is one times four. So I get five over four, and I'm gonna change that to a mixed number. Remember, do your division, five divided by four, which is one, one and one fourth. So your answer is one and one fourth gallons. All right. I hope that helped. If you had any other questions, make sure you ask me in class. Thanks for watching.